You guys! Oh my goodness, I'm super excited for today's video. We're doing a Sanrio Lounge Live book bag haul, wallet, matching book bag, for perfect for Halloween, all that good stuff. But if you're new here, my name is Janie. I do videos on all things cute, whether that's Squishmallow, Squishables, Build a Bear, Lounge Fly, Sanrio, Hot Topic, anything that's cute is gonna end up on this channel. So I was looking to use up my hot cash from Hot Topic like two weeks ago. Basically, if you spend within a certain amount of time, like there's a time frame, then they give you like a coupon. It could be like $30 off a purchase of 60 or something like that. Like I forgot how the ranking goes. I had two of those because because I was spending a lot at Hot Topic. A little too much. I've seen a lot of good lounge fly book bags, specifically Sanrio ones, and I haven't been able to get them all just due to a lack of space. I've talked about this before. Um, and I've kind of been able to battle the sense of FOMO with that and knowing that there's beautiful like Kuromi bags and, and my Melody bags and or Cinema Roll specifically, and knowing that I'm not gonna be able to collect them all or I can, but financially it's not a very sound decision. So, when I got this one, I got it because the deal was really good with my coupons. When I did it, you couldn't stack them. So if this was already on sale, I would have to have paid it full price. It's fine. Either way, with my hot cash, I got a good deal. We're going to do a price breakdown. But I wanted to mention that just because Loungefly does come out with some really gorgeous Sanrio book bags. But the reason I chose this one is because I think it's cute, A. Eh? But also, it was a really good price. Like, I got these both for the price of just a bag. So, let's go over it first. I just took it out of the box yesterday. I went to pick it up, which was, I don't know if that was the best idea. I did an order pickup. That obviously takes a little bit longer. But for me, it was like a safer option because sometimes I'm not home when packages get delivered. But I ended up having to go, because you only have an unlimited number of days to pick them up. So, I ended up having to go on a Saturday at night. And the crowds at the mall at that time. It's a little different. So here's the bag I got. This is Karomi. She is one of those fuzzy ones, which I'm not usually a big fan of. I love how those look. I don't like how they wear over time, but I think if I'm careful, it'll be fine. Um, and the fact that this is a darker gray compared to like Cinema Roll, which is like pure white fluffiness, I think this will probably hold up even better than that one did. Um, but yeah, it has like that super soft material. It has an ear detailing where she has the bows and the witch hat. Mine's a little bit bent just because it's been in a package all day or actually since it's been made you have the collar detailing at the pocket and then if you look on the inside it is like a purple that matches her there's a little insert in there and then on the side it says her universe is this even lounge fly oh my gosh hold on oh my god it's not lounge fly <laughs> It's not lounge fly. I just realized that. It does look like it though. Like I will give you that. That's also probably why it was cheaper then. Okay, so this is her universe. So so Hot Topic sells lounge fly bags, but they also sell her universe, and those tend to be a little bit cheaper, sometimes a little bit smaller, depending on what you're choosing. But I'm okay with this. Like honestly, it's fine. This is smaller than the standard. Actually, not really. Well, we'll compare it because I have a lounge fly here that I just got recently. But yes, okay, so this is not lounge fly. It is her universe. Here's the tag. It's Hello Kitty and Friends. It's part of that new collection that came out. And it was $49.90. So this is the Sanrio Karomi Witch Cosplay book bag. So on the other side, it says Karomi. On this side, it says her universe. On the back, you have her little tail detailing. You have purple, like a deeper purple like strap. And then on the inside, I think it's just purple as well yeah it's just purple as well no extra detailing there but I think it's pretty cute as for the wallet it says Karomi in the back I still have the paper on it I love small wallets I used to like those big ones but now this is just a little bit more convenient for me so on the inside you have a quite a few little slots and you have the section for cash what is that oh just a random thing there so this is also a little bit fuzzy, has her witch hat, the bows on her ears, her little mischievous face. Cute, cute. I'm impressed. I'm happy. I was just, I feel silly that it took me that long to realize it wasn't sand, it wasn't lounge fly, which is fine. But let's do that comparison now that I mentioned it. Alright, this is going to be for another video, but this is a lounge fly Snoopy bag, a Halloween one. It glows in the dark. If anything, I would say the Karomi one's a little bit bigger in this case, but sometimes that's not always what ends up happening. Usually her universe will be a little bit smaller. In terms of quality, I don't really see a difference. I guess I would say Loungefly feels a little bit better, but not really. I feel like Loungefly charges so much 
and yet I don't think the quality is that good. Or if it was at some point, maybe 10 years ago, it's not as, as good anymore. And those prices just continue to skyrocket so much to the point where I'm okay buying from her universe instead. It's funny, this is like a Halloween video and I don't have any like Halloween attire. I'm wearing a tank top because at the time that I'm filming this, it's about to get hot again. We went through a rainy, stormy week and now we're going to be reaching temperatures of 80 degrees again, which is... So sad for me because you know how I feel about summer weather. But wait, I almost forgot the price breakdown. On September 15, I bought the Karomi book bag, which is $49.90 full price, and the wallet, which is $19.90. And then I had the 15 off of 30. Okay, so I only used one like hot cash thing. That means I ended up not using one for a later purchase. That sucks. <laughs> um, but my total was $39.90. And 80 cents and tax was three dollars and 53 cents and because i wasn't shipping it i was picking it up in the store it was zero dollars for shipping and did i say that right tax and then shipping yes so my total was 43 dollars and 33 cents so i think that's a steal i'm kind of sad now that i didn't use that other 15 because i had two hot caches it was 15 dollars off of 30 dollar purchase um, I activated those on the 14th the day before, but yeah, I didn't end up using both of them But it's probably for the best because I've been spending way too much. There is a Karomi, not Karomi Well, I did see that too. There's like a cinema roll tote bag Like an oversized one and I know I heard in the reviews that it's not a lot of space Once you put something inside like the insert where you keep your items in the pouch is not very big But the actual tote is big and it looks really cute I saw it yesterday when I went to pick these up and I was trying to not even browse because as soon as I walked in the associate was like hey how can I help you and I was like oh I'm actually here to pick up an order she's like perfect I'll do it for you right here and she had a tablet on her hand which is really cool it was super convenient but because of that I was like oh maybe this is a sign that I shouldn't be wandering around this store at seven o'clock on a Saturday night when it's full of like high school kids and like people being really disrespectful and let me just go home and not spend money but if you made it to the end of this video thank you so much for watching I really really appreciate it I've been really focused on school lately I am currently in, in like week six of my fall semester uh, taking four classes which I'm gonna really reconsider that next semester but I did it because I was able to get full financial aid in that way anyway if you have any requests for things you want to see not necessarily plushie related even though I do obviously have a bunch I'm still working on the update of what the room is looking like on the outside but more so like other things you'd like to see like I got a coloring book recently and I kind of want to do some videos about it so I've been on TikTok a lot more recently and I've been seeing adult coloring books and this has been a trend for the past 10 years but the adult coloring books that I grew up with have been super duper intricate to the point where it gives me anxiety instead of calming me down whereas this is just super cutesy fun amazing super sweet whimsical artwork and this isn't even from the most popular seller there's a girl who sells these and and it sells out within minutes she'll sell them in bigger batches with each launch and it sells out in seconds so I'm thinking of maybe doing a series about this too you know buy some markers see what I do but we'll see if that's something that interests you let me know I'm trying to kind of branch out a little bit because my niche is all things cute now I'm hoping I'm able to better implement other style videos other than just the plushies and the book bags because of spacing issues and I have to get a storage unit I really don't know how to do that I know I do know how but the place near me has really bad reviews so it's kind of scary like what if someone breaks in or what if the rats eat all my things I have no idea if you live in New York City and you have a storage unit let me know where you got it. Let me know what the company is, please. Thank you. Anyway, if you made it to the end, thank you so much. As always, I really, really appreciate it. Stay safe out there. Stay hydrated. And until next time. <laughs>